Hello and welcome to Teach Me Money Methods. In this video, we're going to go over how to make money on Fiverr in 2020. So the question you might be asking is, is Fiverr too saturated or oversaturated in 2020? And I would just say that as being a Fiverr seller uh, for many years, uh, Fiverr has more sellers than it ever has. However, it also has more buyers than it ever has. So if you think about Amazon, Amazon has continued to grow year after year after year, and it's uh, almost um, unimaginable to think that they can still grow when they have, you know, the entire world buying their product and millions of customers that have credit cards on hand on file ready to just push a button and buy things. But they just continue to get more of the market share. And Fiverr is a lot like that. They've been around for years now and they've continued to show uh, growth on the platform. More people know about it. More people are using the services. And as that growth occurs, yes, more people are, are uh, more likely and attracted to selling and trying to make money on the platform as well. But the amount of customers outweighs how many people are still on the platform selling. So there's just so many services that you can sell on Fiverr and there's new ones added every month. So, and I'm going to show you that an example of that, where new categories of um, services and products are identified um, all the time. And Fiverr does a good job. I'm going to show you that um, how you can get into different niches and markets on Fiverr and have a better chance at um, having a successful gig because you're offering something that's, less competitive because Fiverr just decided to make it a category because they were seeing more and more people, more and more need uh, on the mar in the market for it. So selling services is the fastest way to start earning on Fiverr. So there's different things you can do. You can sell PLR books and you can uh, sell things that are already done. Like if even you could sell an online course um, for five or 10 bucks or whatever you want to charge. But, most people coming to Fiverr, most customers that are coming to Fiverr are looking for a particular service uh, on the platform. So they're going to go to the platform. They're going to look there. They need a voiceover done. Um, they need a video created. They need a you. They have a YouTube channel and they want someone to start doing the, all the videos for them. Uh, they need video editing done. They need proofreading done. They need article writing done. So those are all services that you're paying somebody and then they're going to put in the time and effort to uh, achieve that task for you. And it's an exchange for money and time. Um, it's you, every time you deliver a gig like this, a service, it's unique um, every time, as opposed to just buying a product like a shirt. Uh, you're not selling shirts on Fiverr, right? So um, let's check out some of my earnings and strategies uh, and how I'm making money on the Fiverr platform. I come in here under my account analytics, you know, it's only one of those side type gigs that I'm doing. Um, I talk about a lot of different things on the channel, low and no content books. Um, and I talk about Fiverr. I talk about uh, my classes on Udemy, um, making money several different ways. <clears throat> but you can see I kind of turned this back on um, this year. Did I make any? No, I didn't make any in... I made four dollars in February, so wasn't doing much. But then I pretty much flipped it back on. I took a long break, and then I flipped it back on, and I made three hundred forty-four bucks in. Um, and I actually made no, I made more than that. I made almost four hundred dollars, as you can see right here, almost four hundred dollars in March, and then it's been steady, almost a hundred dollars a month. Um, and then it's only June eleventh, and I'm already. Um, indicating I'm going to make over a hundred this month on Fiverr as well. And like I said, I only do a few things here and there. Um, a lot of days I don't have any um, gigs to uh, complete, but if you put in the effort and you get some good gigs up, you could turn this in uh, to making 500 to a thousand dollars a month. And uh, so, you know, and just to show you that it's not just from one gig, you know, I can go, I'll actually show you some orders just to show you that, you get a bunch of um, different, so I can come into completed. And I know I've talked about 
voiceovers, uh, which has been my primary uh, thing that I've delivered, my primary gig. But so, I mean, yeah, look, recorded a 600 uh, voiceover right there. That was on June 8th, June 9th, June 6th, June 6th, June 4th, June 4th, June 3rd. So you can see I'm getting orders May, you know, so I'm getting orders and look, I got the voiceover gig, but then look at this. I got to create, create a kinetic t um, text video with free human uh, voiceover. Uh, which is a really unique gig offering. Most people do a kinetic gig, or I mean a kinetic video for you, or a voiceover, but they don't do both in the same. So that's why people, someone bought my gig. I got a five-star review and it, I made $10. Um, I've got... I've got this other one where I'll work on a Udemy course, but you know, this person actually ordered, um, was looking at this and saw some of my video editing skills. And so they asked me, Hey, can you, um, help me out with, I've got three motivational videos that I need editing done. And I was able to help them out. I created a custom uh, order for them and we knocked, I knocked them out. And so um, that was like, I don't even have a gig offering for video editing, but I ended up doing three videos, video editing. Well, actually um, they're, they're set to pay me for the other videos, but um, you know, I earned a quick 30 bucks on one video. That was one video and I earned $30 voiceover, um, you know, different, different things here. And then look at this one. I even, you know, I do some low content stuff, uh, low content uh, publishing on KDP, Amazon KDP. I'm planning on doing more videos to show you what I'm doing on the platform. Um, I haven't done any videos since about December, January, when I started uh, working on the platform a little bit. Um, I haven't done much with it lately, uh, but I'd like to um, do some more um, videos on that. But um, I do have a service, make you a custom coloring book with quotes. And someone paid me $110 to create a, a coloring book for them. And uh, I had just posted this um, gig, uh, like maybe 48, it might've been up for 48 hours. I got a five-star review, one order, 110 bucks, boom. So, you know, and then look, I created a Udemy course down here and I got a tip for a hundred bucks. I got paid a 400 bucks for the um, order. Um, and then here's another one for the create connect typography right there again. So you can see that it's not just, um, and then I even have um, my websites and I've published guest posts um, for, so you can see that it's not just one gig that's making the money. It's, um, it's a lot. And I have a bunch of gigs now that I'm a level two, I've moved, finally moved up to level two seller. Um, I now have um, 18 or 19 gigs posted. I can have up to 20 gigs posted right now. So if I go to switch to buying and I just want to show you um, some different things you can do. I was obviously doing some research here. Um, you know, if you do um, low content and let's just see what kind of stuff for low content there is low content. <laughs> you got, you guys know how popular low content is right now, right? There's so many channels on, on YouTube. There's just um, thousands of people that are publishing on Amazon KDP platform. And look, there's only 148 services right now for low content. I didn't even put in low content, KDP, Amazon. I didn't put publishing in there, just low content. Let's see how much, um, if I put KDP, KDP, there's a thousand, but KDP also means everything. Um, and you know, uh, it's also going to include all the Kindle stuff and you know, like create space, Kindle, that's all outdated stuff. So low content is really more specific to the niche that we're looking for. And so look at, there's only 148 services right here. You could get on, you could sell, if you're good at creating interiors, if you're good at creating, um, uh, book covers, um, or anything like that. And you know, if you, you come in here, low content and look at all the different reviews so that there is a niche for this all on the first page, people have, are getting reviews and getting orders. And this one stood out to me. Let's check this one out. Creating covers. I was thinking about creating this as a gig as well, but look, three orders in the queue. Um, for creating uh, low content uh, covers right there. So you can do it that way, but then another way you can do it. And that just shows you that as massive as the platform is, you know, uh, Fiverr, millions of customers, and there's probably hundreds of thousands of sellers on Fiverr. Look, there's still niches that you can get in that are com completely untapped. 
148 services available for low content. That's completely untapped. You can get in right now and start getting some um, some sales as well. And um, and then another way to look at um, another way that I like to look is if you go to graphic and design, look at you'll see these things pop out. They say new. So that means that uh, they're new cat product categories, right? Pattern design. Let's see. That's a new category that Fiverr um, has identified. And there's anything under 2000 is going to be, um, I would consider, um, not competitive. Look at all these patterns. You can use these in, for um, low content as well. You can use them for um, clothing, all kinds of stuff. But then you go into different ones, right? So uh, podcast marketing. I wonder how many services are available for that. See, only 500 are available for that. Obviously, if you go to... Um, let's say, um, where's audio, um, music and audio, and you go to voiceover, you know, I sell a service, uh, that I make, uh, I do pretty well on, and there's 18,000 voiceover artists. Like I'm not going to be on the first page, not going to be on the first page for that one, but I do have a niche. I um, mean, if you type in 600 words, let's see if I pull up on the page 600 words um, are, yep, I do. I pull, I'm uh, ranked um, 4, 8, 12, 13, 14. I'm ranked number 15 for just 600 words. You can see where there's my gig right there. And if you typed in uh, voiceover, I should be ranked in the top four. And there I am. So I do have a little uh, niche. Um, when people find mine, they like it because I'm offering more words than anybody's gonna going to offer. Uh, but, you know, you just cruise through video and animation. Um, they're starting to get, um, so they, once it starts getting a little bit f uh, more activity. So where is the screencast, screencasting videos I've noticed. So it only has 237. So it was, it had the new mark on it for a while, but there's only 237 services right here. So you could, you can get in on this stuff. And you can, you know, go up to some of the top ones like this one right here. Does it, is he, does he have orders in his queue? Yes, he has two orders in his queue. So he's got a minimum of $80 in his queue right now. So I hope you're seeing the potential on Fiverr. All you had to do is just uh, do some research, uh, use your skill set, and then create gigs. Go to, you know, go back over to, you know, switch to selling and go to gigs <clears throat> and then go to create new gig right here, this button right here, and then just start creating your gig. It takes five minutes. You'll have a gig up and running and traffic going to it, and you can start making some money on the platform. So uh, for my next video, if you have a suggestion for the, my next video, please leave it in the comments below, and I'd be happy to check it out and see if I, what I can do. If I have uh, knowledge of the subject, then I'll make a video on it for you. If you are interested in starting your business or taking your fiber business to the next level, check out my course below. It is at an introductory price at only $1. Get in before the price goes up to $67. It's a great course. And if you wouldn't mind, please liking and subscribing if you want to see more videos like this. Until the next video, take care.